Check out this epic feast we made using maple pellets in the Traeger. Today we are smoking with limited edition pellets. Let's roll. I'm the type of person that if I'm gonna smoke something in the Traeger pellet grill, I'm gonna look all over my house and see how many things I can load up in there. Thank you so much to Traeger for sending out these Traeger Louisville Slugger maple pellets to test out. I was really inspired and wondering exactly how this light but subtly sweet flavor was going to pair with some of my favorite things to make in the smoker. And first up were some lovely chickens. So I have really good recipes for smoked whole chickens at sipbyco.com that you can look up. It's a pretty easy method. I start these out at 250 degrees Fahrenheit in the smoker, which I'll show you in a second. I just prep everything to begin with though. So I also made some smoked baked potatoes and here I'm cutting up some onion and yummy already cooked bacon to make some smoked Brussels sprouts, which is by far one of my favorite smoker side dishes. Everyone loves them and they don't take very long to cook at all. I chose really complimentary things to smoke all together here. So they were done within the same amount of time or at least if I pulled out the sides early, they were done or they were still warm by the time the smoked whole chicken was done. I do recommend using both racks when you're going to smoke something as epic as this meal. I like to put something like the smoked baked potatoes right on the top rack and then three chickens in one little like casserole dish filled with those Brussels sprouts smoked really well on the same level. Look at this. Now you wouldn't want like your chicken to be dripping onto your baked potatoes unless you knew that they'd be completely done when it was cooking. That's why I like putting the meat on the bottom. So baked potatoes are so good and they're gonna stay warm for a long time after you take them off the, sp the smoker grill. And let me just tell you what I think about all this. So basically using maple pellets for smoking food on a Traeger pellet grill will provide a medium light smoky flavor. It's not as intense as a hickory or one of my favorites, which is mesquite, but it is really good. And because it's lighter and subtly sweet, this means that it pairs well with lighter meats, including pork and chicken and turkey, vegetables like you saw here, and even baked goods like smoked apple pie. Check out more recipes on Sip Bite Go.